on my way to my first solo trip. High five. You're leaving us. Yoo-hoo! We're happy. Yoo-hoo! Whatever. <laughs> Whatever it is. Cuídate mucho, mi amor. My first solo trip. Yeah. And guess where I'm going? I'm going to Colombia, Cartagena. A lot of research what area to go in Colombia. Cartagena is actually the most touristy area to go to. I'll be staying at my first hostel ever. It's called Viajando. And Viajando has a chain of hostels all around the world. I'll be staying with a bunch of girls. So I'll be bunking and rooming with a bunch of girls. And I am so excited because they have activities and I'll be able to interact with people around the world and make new friends and get to know everybody. I can't wait. I'll be doing a lot of videos of the food the culture the lifestyle the activities everything so stay tuned you don't want to miss Catherine thank you, thank you. Guys, I made it! My first hostel! It's so cute! Now I'm gonna change and off to an activity. Let's go! So right now I'm going to the walls of Cartagena. These walls have been around since the 1500s when pirates sailed the sea. They were built to keep the city safe from attacks. The walls took a very long time to build, almost 200 years. Como de defensa y ataque, este es el baluarte San Lucas para que vean los cañones. Por eso tienen los cañones, garitas. Allá para que tomen una linda foto en la garita para que vean. Today, these walls are famous and people from all around the world come to see them. You can walk on top of the walls and see the beautiful sea and city. It's like a stepping into a storybook from long ago. As many know, this is my first solo trip ever. Usually I fly alone, but I always know somebody of where I'm going. This time, I don't know nobody in Colombia. So I'll be meeting a lot of people. As a female solo traveler, I came prepared. Got my pepper spray on. I decided not to take an Uber because everything's so close and distant. Oh, look at the horse. Everything's so walking distance that I decided to save a couple dollars. I just finished eating at Café del Mar, saw the sunset there, beautiful sunset oh, to die for.
Paso Arepas, and I just met like the greatest people in the world in the hospital I'm staying at. Shaman, what's good? Shaman, like, what's your ID? Like, show yourself out. Oh, no, we ain't about that. <laughs> My name is Puneet. Puneet with three E's and a B. That's your Instagram name? Yeah, that's why. Yeah, I might as well shout myself out too. Because yeah. I know it's going to blow up. So, at Sean Mundra. So, you guys got to figure that one out on your own, actually. Oh. Cheers. Yeah. Sure. Cheers. Mm. That's good. Mm -hmm. So we're here at the hostel. We're back at the hostel. And oh my god, I meet more people! This is my good friend. She's from the Netherlands. Look how awesome she is. She's 22, guys. And she's traveling on her own. Like, I'm too old to be traveling at this age. And look at her courage. You have faith and courage. Colombia, carajo! Vamos! <laughs> Yes! Yeah. Shout out yourself. Tell the people your Instagram. What do you want to do? <laughs> I want to be a physics teacher really bad. So. Well, she is going to be a physics teacher. Watch. Just watch. Manifest it. <laughs> I have the best choreographer ever. Having a good time doing some salsa. Just got some really good food as well. Oh, yeah. Cartagena, guys. Cartagena. <laughs> Today we're going to Rosario Island, one of the islands here in Cartagena. It's 45 minutes by boat. Got a package, and the package also includes lunch, snorkeling, and of course the beautiful view on the boat. So I am so excited. I am still here at the hostel. I'm gonna have some breakfast and then head out. So come along with me. Yesterday's boat ride was so much fun. I had a blast. I ate, I slept, I danced, I drank. I met so many people from all around the world. I am loving it. Now I'm heading to breakfast, so I'm gonna go eat. Tonight I'm going on a boat party, and it's like a catch the sunset on the boat and just have a good time, mingle, meet some people. Follow me to go eat right now. We got everything we need right here Wine and burning chemistry You and me alone The traditional Colombian dish The arepas are so small So right now I'm walking on Kitsimani Road It has a lot of vendors, a lot of um, carts with food Also people selling hats Super cute area, check this out
So my favorite part of the trip, really, it has been all the people I have met. I really thought I was gonna feel alone and I have not once felt alone in this trip. So many people from around the world, we will go out to eat together in groups, know each other. I loved it, that's like my favorite part. Although, also my second favorite part is the architect. These um, buildings and the way that they were built and the walls, the Cartagena walls, and so much history, so I love it all. Have some coconut, it's so hot here, like it's crazy. Dios te guarde y te bendiga. Bienvenida a mi país. Que te lleve la mejor imagen de nosotros. Y con lluvia y con bendición, vea. Con... Guys, look how cute. This is handmade by his family. Beautiful person. He is at Plaza here. It's raining. Santo Domingo Plaza. You guys have to check him out. Bienvenido, ya saben. Cristian, ahí en, en la plaza, en el árbol. Sí. Soy buena cultura. Me gusta el medio ambiente, me gusta el mar, los atardeceres. <laughs> y vengan para que lo disfruten. Sí, he loves good vibes, positivity. He'll, he'll tell you a little bit about what each stone means. Buena compradora, buena compradora. Ojalá vengan todos así, <laughs> apoyar la cultura colombiana. <laughs> Tenemos cultura. Yes, they no have es, lots of culture. No todos somos malos. Habemos también gente buena. <laughs> He said that Salud. not everybody is bad. There's good people here. We all want just great people around us. And look how cute. Like he just said that I was his big sale. So I'm so happy I was able to help him. Bye. Bye guys. What I'm planning to do right now, I've been wanting this for a while. I wanted to get it in Thailand, but that didn't happen. I'm in Colombia now. I'm gonna get a tattoo. Yep. I'm getting a tattoo. I have different options that I want to get. I'm not 100% sure just yet. I'm gonna go visit this tattoo artist. So I came to Ardo Tattoo Shop. He has great reviews. Check it out. Owner of the shop, Aldo. Así se dice Aldo. Ardo Tattoo. <laughs> Super cool vibes. And I'm gonna get it on the back of my arm. With the service, the time, you did a great job. If you guys are ever in Cartagena, come visit Acto Tattoo Studio. <laughs> I love it! Ready! So now I am going to a boat party. It's an um, open bar, also, there's gonna be some food. I hope so. But you get to dance you get to meet new people from around the world super cool i found it on TripAdvisor, so let's see how it is Ciudad de Cartagena. A ver, chicos, les recuerdo que son dos horitas de recorrido con barra libre. 
Por lo tanto, cero caras de entierro si van a ser de entierro, que sean de los felices. Ok, aquí el que no vino a rumbear se equivocó de bote. Vamos a conocer un poco la tripulación en el día de hoy. Nuestro capitán a bordo, Maluma. Un fuerte aplauso para Maluma. ¡Vamos! ¡Eso! Chicos, yo soy Kenny. Muchos me dicen Kenny Bell por el exceso de alcohol que les doy. Fuerte aplauso para Kenny Bell. ¡Vamos! ¡Fuerte, vamos! ¡Eso! start today last night was so much fun I danced my ass off my feet hurt where did you go Catherine I went to Tambor nightclub do you recommend for other people going to Car going to Cartagena um, it's the only nightclub I've been to so yeah <laughs> and my rag for everyone out there is uh, Elvisa nightclub it's popping pretty much every night a lot of things going on top floor is house music third floor is like a Okay, maybe I'll go there tonight. Yeah. It's my last day, guys. Cheers. Cheers. Thank you. You're not gonna say nothing? <laughs> we have a camera shot. <laughs> the only one that is the one that is number one is the What you eat? I got the churro French toast. Churro? Wow, that looks good. Yeah, it's sick. Oh, I got the Ava toast and the basic option. It's a pleaser. We're actually going to rate the food, guys. That's the idea for this part of the video. We're going to each take take a bite of each other's food, see how it tastes, and come back with the reviews. Exactly, and I'm eating. Oh, yeah. They're gonna call for you. They're gonna call for you on the. Shout out, shout out. We're gonna see which one is better. I really like my French toast. Just eating, and I am full. Uh, my favorite was the French toast. That's what he ordered. What's your favorite? Mm, I'm trying to decide between the avocado toast and the French toast, but. I think I'm also gonna have to just hand it to the to the to the French toast. To the French toast. We ate all of Ashan's French toast. It's <laughs> <laughs> a ten. Yeah, so I mean, I guess that's just my you know. It's highly recommended. So we're back at the hostel. We're just gonna chill. We're really full right now. Guys, I took a nap on the hammock. It was so good. I was so tired. So now I'm gonna go eat at Restaurante Cande. It's a Caribbean spot. I really want fish. And yeah, they have um, good ratings. And I really love the way their food looks. So let's check it out. My last night in Cartagena, Colombia. Fried fish was so good. It tastes like I didn't need any sauce. The amount of salt and flavor it had 
so good and it was so like it's huge i ate most of it i had dessert i had this like coconut pie with this ice cream oh my god i love this ice cream i'm walking back to the hostel i'm just gonna watch a movie i'm looking at the gps to know which way to go but yeah i'm just gonna there's a movie theater in the hostel i'm just gonna watch a movie and just chill out and go to sleep early i want to wake up early tomorrow so good morning hey today is the day that i leave back home but let me tell you about my first experience at a hostel amazing time if you are solo traveling you definitely need to stay at a hostel you meet so many people from all around the world you don't feel alone I had a great time on this trip I learned a lot from other people as well as I learned more about myself today I'll be leaving I'm gonna get some breakfast and then head to the airport so let's go Breakfast was great. I want to say this trip has helped me mentally, physically, everything, and I'm so happy I got the chance to even take this trip as well as any future trips I'll be taking. Okay, that's Catherine Meets World. Ah! Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like this video, and hit the bell for more notifications because I'll be back with more.